I start my job at 3.30 and I end at about 9.30. I'm a three-quarter time student here for the school. Part of Logan Stiles' job description as custodial supervisor here in the Spory building is to clean and maintain and assure that all restroom products are replaced when needed. His manager, Doug Watson, is part of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints Chemical Committee. I would say safety has to be your number one concern. We have a, uh, a, a vendor that uh, actually has the church-wide contract that works hand-in-hand -hand with, with uh, making sure we have products to the utmost for the safety, for uh, you know, antibacterial soaps, to Perel hand sanitizers, to all the other chemical products that we use on campus and those products are uh, kind of tested. Uh, the church every once in a while will go through different tests. These tests have allowed products such as Gojo antibacterial soap to be used on campus. But what about the triclosan in it? Triclosan is an antibiotic used in this product and others, and some students speculate that if enough is ingested, it could attack the body's natural bacteria used for digestion. I don't believe triclosan poses a significant risk at all. Well, if you have a lot of triclosan on your hands and then eat food from that, could that get into your system? Possibly. There's a possibility that it could. You would have to eat the soap and okay. eat lots of the soap. You'd have to drink the liquid soap. And of course, that would give you lots of other problems. You would start to worry about a lot of other things before you began to worry about the triclosan. <laughs> for BYU-Idaho, I'm Shane Carlson.